Hey, what's up? It's DJ Mac again, and I'm still messing around with Pulse Locker, and it seems to be working fine. Um, just had a couple of, uh, not like playback issues or anything, but um, just like finding songs um, that I thought should be on there, but they aren't. Um, I tried to look for Blue Cheese by UMCs. It wasn't on there. Um, I don't know if you know you have to send in a request to get a certain song on Pulse Locker. Um, but currently, as I'm making this video, it's not on there, so I'll even type it in. Um, and I do not see it on there. Um, but for the most part, it does have like a lot of, um, you know, old school music in there. But um, again, it's up to Pulse Lockers, people that, you know, that upload certain songs, so not everything is on there. Um, also what I noticed is um, the clean versions and radio edit versions um, not every radio edit version is, is on there. Um, I tried doing like radio edit and I uh, just found that you know it's kind of pick and choose on certain things that that you'll find on here. Um, you're definitely gonna find like a lot of like you know, covers to certain certain songs. Um, but what I do to avoid that, I just type in, you know, original. So if it's like a Michael Jackson song, like Be It, I'll make sure to type in, you know, original. Um, and just, you know, type in Michael Jackson. And see what comes up. But um, for the most part, just always look for the original. Because again, you're, you're always going to run into that, like, you know, some type of cover. It's kind of annoying because it's like, you know, you shouldn't be having any uh, cover to, to any song, really. Because, like, if you're looking for a certain song, you're looking for the original for the most part. You know, you're never, like, looking for a remix version. You're always, like, if you get any requests for a certain song, it's most likely going to be the, the original uh, version of it. So... That's something that, you know, is a gripe on my end. Because, you know, you want to just play the, the original version of the, of the song. So, but, um, for the most part, like, it works, you know. Like, you're going to find, um, you know, the songs that you're looking for. Especially if they're, like, if they're classics and they're, like, really popular songs. Um, you're definitely going to find them. So it definitely gets you out of a pinch. Um, but seeing that this is like the beta version, <clears throat> it it's working fine. I I have never gotten like <clears throat> excuse me. I've never gotten a dropout, um, a, you know, of any song. So while I'm playing songs, songs have never like stopped playing or you know had any type of glitch or anything like that. Nothing nothing really glitched up. Um, I was playing songs on a daily basis uh, ever since I got it so yeah um, but since I work with uh, Tractor I'm gonna see if I can um, you know just build my library up on here as well um, and yeah just uh, see if I can actually use this on a gig test it out you know you have to you have to eventually test it out you know in a real setting um, and I'm not afraid of doing that because I can always open up, you know, Tractor and Serato at the same time. So, um, which I don't always suggest because it's a lot of like CPU power. But you know, if something else doesn't work, just always have like you know your iTunes or something open, ready to go, um, and have like a mix in case any any audio dropouts. But for the most part, um, you know, be prepared. Always be prepared for something that could happen. But um, right now, it's it's working perfectly fine. Um, I'm pretty impressed. I, I gotta admit, I'm pretty impressed that you know you could just type in any popular song that you may have not, um, you know, gotten off of any website or anything like that. Like you're just like, hey, you know what? I got a gig, and then I'm like, oh, I forgot to download like the latest songs, but you're already at the gig. This can save your life. You know what I mean? Because you're always gonna get that one person. You're not a real DJ because you don't have this song, and you know, 
it's like now you can actually get that song so I guess you're a real DJ now because <laughs> you have the power of the internet to, to have access to those songs that people always ask for um, so yeah um, but everything works so. So, um, without further ado, I'd like to say goodbye and thank you. And if you have any questions, you can always email me at bboymag27 at gmail.com. All right. Talk to you all later. Peace.